Hey everyone, this is your math guru. In this video, I'm going to be solving the following algebraic equations using the balance method or the additive and multiplicative inverses. Please don't forget to click on the like and subscribe button below for more easy to understand math concept. In the first example, we have 5x plus 2 equals 22. We are going to start by taking out 2 and using the balance method because 2 here is a plus, we are going to take it out by subtracting 2 from both sides. Whatever you do on your left, you do on your right. So we have 5x plus 2 minus 2 equals 22 minus 2. Simplifying 2 minus 2, that's 0. We are left with 5x equals 22 minus 2, that's 20. Now, between 5 and x is a multiplication, and the inverse of multiplication is division. So we are going to be dividing both sides by 5. 5 here, 1, 5 here, 1. We are left with x equals 20 divided by 5, that's 4. So for this equation, using the balance method, the value of x is 4. And the check is 4 times 5, that's 20, plus 2 will give us 22. In the second example, we have 7 equals 4x minus 5. Using the balance method, the inverse of minus 5 is plus 5, so we are going to be adding 5 to both sides. We have 7 plus 5 equals 4x minus 5 plus 5. Minus 5 plus 5, that's 0. 7 plus 5, that's 12. So we have 12 equals 4x. Between 4 and x is a multiplication. So to find the inverse, which is division, we're going to divide both sides by 4. Balance method, whatever you do on your left, you do on your right. 4 divided by 4, that's 1. 12 divided by 4, that's 3 equals to x and the check is 7 equals 4 times 3 that's 12 minus 5 is equal to 7. In the third example I have 3 minus 2x equals to 7. We start by taking out our 3 because it's a plus 3 we're going to be add subtracting 3 from both sides. So we have 3 minus 2x minus 3 equals to 7 minus 3. 3 minus 3, that cancels because that gives us 0. I'm left with minus 2x. Don't forget the signs. Equals 7 minus 3, that's positive 4. Minus 2x equals to 4. Taking out minus 2, I'm going to be dividing both sides by minus 2. Whatever I do on my left, I do on my right. And I'm doing that because I want to isolate my variable, which is x. Minus 2 divided by minus 2, that's 1. I'm left with x equals 4 divided by minus 2, that's minus 2. And the check is 3 minus 2 times minus 2, that's 4. So plus 4 will give me 7. In my last example, I have 7x minus 8 equals to 6. Taking out minus 8, I'm going to be adding 8 to both sides. That's the inverse of negative 8. So I have 7x minus 8 plus 8. And because I'm doing the balance method, or using the balance method, I'm going to be adding the 8 to both sides. Minus 8 plus 8, that's 0. I'm left with 7x equals 6 plus 8, 14. To get rid of 7, or to isolate my x, I'm going to divide both sides by 7. 7 divided by 7, that's 1. I'm left with x equals 14 divided by 7, 2. And the quick check is 2 times 7, that's 14, minus 8. That will give me 6. Thanks for watching. Bye.